Okay, last time we dealt with uh, locations. Uh, this time we're going to briefly go over the rest of this. Now, descriptions, a lot like what we added on uh, the right click process with the addition of copyright. So, basically, maybe I want to put all this information on all the pictures. So, I'm going to highlight and copy. Then I'm going to come down here, select all, and I can paste all that in. And we can add everything from one to the other just by copy pasting. But I I'm not going to go into deep detail here. Uh, this one, it's when the picture was taken. As you can see, the time's a little different. So when we select them all, we get multiple values here. Now other, we can add source, instructions, subject reference, caption writer, credit, event, usage terms, peoples, Category is uh, category, intellectual genre, scenes, urgency, status, supplemental categories, shot. This gives you information of the settings on the camera. Let's just go to one of them. You get to see that nice and plain there. Camera. Is an E43 model Nikon software, Microsoft Photo Tools, and photographer. Here you're going to be want to be a little careful. If you're going to put the photo on the internet, you may not want to put all that information in unless maybe you're a professional and want to put that in. But that's oh yeah, I should tell you. Once you've edited everything, you're going to want to come over here, uh, save all images. As you can see, the stars are disappearing, means they had changes. Now, say for instance, you wanted to put in uh, a description of who's who, you can actually type type them in one at a time in here or find one of the other categories but this is probably a good one and save each individ each picture individually and you'll have everything looking very nice and sweet so that's pretty much uh, photo pro photo tools in a nutshell You've got little options you can play with. Images read only. Image contains GPS information. Image can saved, contains unsaved information. Uh, clear error messages. Tasks. Those are the things that are already on the screen. Change the layout, whether the pictures are to the uh, left or at the bottom that's the data above and how the you want the GPS to come in uh, how to sort the images and this is just basic file information so I think this program's worth giving it a try see if you enjoy it maybe it's useful maybe it's not but it uh, never hurts to give your genealogy pictures uh, a good label. I hope you enjoy.